Hi guys, so in today's video I'll be creating this new year's party makeup look. All the products used in this video will be mentioned in the description box below along with their prices so please check that out. Also please subscribe to my channel and hit that bell button to stay uploaded about all my future uploads and now let's jump into the video. I'll be starting off with my eye makeup today so first of all I'll be taking this Lakme blur perfecting primer and applying it on my eyelids and under eyes now i'll be priming my eyelids using my concealer which is from wet and wild and then also applying a bit on my under eyes now taking this micro mini beauty blender i'll be blending that concealer out and then we'll begin the show with this palette from hilary roda now since today's look is going to be all red so we are going to start off with a light red shade and applying it on my crease I'll be using this color as my transition shade. Yes you heard that right. Now imagine if the transition shade is so dark how dark is the eye look about to be. Now blending that eyeshadow in windshield wiper motion i will be blending it out and i am already in love with this look now i'll be taking this slightly deeper red shade like it was kind of maroon and then i'll be placing it on my outer corner so that it deepens my eyes and gives it an excellent dimension and i will be building up the intensity of the color and then blending it with that transition color now taking this rose gold shimmery shade from the Sivana colors eyeshadow palette and oh my god look at my face I was shook I was literally shook so I'll be applying the shimmery shade on my eyelids and then again blend all of these colors together to achieve the final eye look now moving on to my face, I'll be taking that same primer and this time I'll be warming it up between my fingers, applying it on my face and blend it in dabbing motion. And now I'll give my primer to sit for 5 minutes and in the meanwhile, wow, 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 I've changed my outfit into the party makeup look. Now I will be dotting my foundation from Wet n Wild and using this pack beauty blender i'll be blending my foundation always make sure that whenever you're blending anything on your face except for eyeshadow you should always use dabbing motions no matter what whether you're doing it with a brush or whether you're doing it with a beauty sponge always dab next i'll be taking this concealer again and of course we have to hide those hard dark circles so yes, applying the concealer on my dark circles and a little bit on my acne marks and taking that same micro mini beauty blender and I'm blending that concealer like nobody's business to make it look flawless. Yes, now I'll be taking my wet and wild mega glow contour kit and with that setting powder i'll be setting my under eyes so that they do not crease yes i'm doing that and now i'll be slightly baking baking is a procedure wherein you keep the powder under your eyes to give it a brightening effect for like five minutes or so so that your skin absorbs the pigment now taking that same powder on a fluffy brush I'll be setting my entire face and then taking that same brush same palette I'll be taking the brown shade and contour my face to of course make it look chiseled and then taking it on my jawline so that yeah I have a double chin now i'll be wiping off that powder which i had kept for baking and you can see how instantly bright my under eyes look like dark circles who now taking this blush i'll be blushing my cheeks and giving it a flush of a color like this color is so beautiful guys i mean i used to be damn scared of blushes but since i started using this i love blushes 
Now my favorite part. Ta ta da. It is the highlighter and with this fan brush I will be applying lots of highlighter like lots of highlighter on the high points of my face that is my cheekbones, my nose tip, my cupid's bow and then my forehead. Like I can literally drench in this. Now taking this eyebrow pencil which also has a brush i'll be drawing my eyebrows first i'm going to start outlining it and then i'll start filling it up and then with the comb side of the pencil i'll just make sure that everything is blended you see the difference what a structure it gives repeating the same thing on my other eye and then of course whenever you're coloring something you do tend to you know take it out outside the lines at times so cleaning those lines with my concealer and then blending it out seamlessly and that completes the eyebrows and the lights went off i got damn scared after the lights came back i took my eyeliner and i created a small winged liner to give it that sexy and edgy look like look at how beautiful that makes the entire eye look now taking this kajal pencil from faces canada i'll be applying the kajal on my waterline and then i'll be taking the red shade again from the hillary roda palette and smudging my waterline so that it makes the eye look look very put together moving to my next step and of course everybody dances in parties so we'll be applying a waterproof mascara and this mascara is bombdegree.com Though I had applied my lipstick when the lights went off, I will be retouching it so that you know it stays all night long, and that's the finished look. I hope you all enjoyed watching. Also, my other social media handles are given in the description box, so you all can follow me there as well. I'll see you guys in my next video. Till then, bye.